I'm here at HP Discover in Madrid with Mark Alien, and your company, Six Square, has done some work with the European Space Agency, which I think sounds exciting. Can you tell me what you're doing? Absolutely. So, I mean, European Space Agency has been a customer of ours for, for quite a while now, but recently we, um, uh, we won a, a contract uh, in, in, in really fierce competition uh, to basically build a, uh, a big data at the edge uh, system uh, to, to, uh, to address the challenge of recording uh, the raw signals from, um, from space, from the, uh, the GNSS constellations, so the constellations like GPS or Galileo, things that are helping us figure out where we are positioning and, 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 and accurate time. And um, uh, they realized that uh, a cloud-only uh, solution was, was not possible because it, it produces, each station produces 21 terabytes of data daily. Oh, wow. right, so so they, they, they needed a, uh, an edge to cloud solution. So that's what we've, we've done with uh, NSL, which is it's a it's great success because it's two European you know, small companies that managed to, uh, to beat some, some pretty impressive uh, uh, market leaders. So that's, that's what we're, we're doing. And uh, so we brought with us uh, our, our partnership with HPE to materialize the, uh, the edge uh, system. And so how, so how does HPE, since we're here at uh, yeah, HPE yeah. Discover, how does, how does HPE fit into this whole picture? So basically we're targeting the edge line um, series for, for, for this. So we're using the, uh, the EL4000 packed right, with uh, as much compute and, and, and memory as, and, uh, as possible um, so that we allow uh, users, so the, the, the scientists that are sieving through this, this, this deluge of, of data um, by deploying AI modules, for example, that, that it's like a stethoscope into, into this pipe, try to figure out where are the golden nuggets that will need to be replicated in the cloud to do further deep, deep learning and, and, and figure out what, what's, what's going on. So, so what kind of problems is this solving for the space agency? Are they like, I mean, are, are you finding intelligent life in other planets? Or? <laughs> so there, there's sort of um, uh, industry things that, uh, you know, you, you know, so many systems rely on, on GPS-like uh, signals, right? So for positioning and, and, and accurate timing. And now we have drones and, and all of those mobile systems that are coming on. So we, they, they need to be ruggedized. You know, we need to be able to detect better when there's jamming around them and, and to, to make that, those, those uh, systems safer. So that's sort of the, uh, the pragmatic approach to improve that, 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 that system. But then there's also at the, the other edge uh, uh, is the, uh, the other side is, uh, uh, some, for example, a scientist uh, speculated that perhaps there is evidence that just before an earthquake, something happens in the atmosphere. Um, and then because the signal, the, the, the GPS signal, goes through the atmosphere, uh, it, gets, it gets modified by the atmosphere. So if we, can, we could use perhaps a network of those stations to, to create a, an early warning system of an earthquake or a tsunami. Right? So, so every second saves lives. Right? So if we can do a few minutes, then that, that it, could be, it could be awesome. So all of those things are potential uh, uh, results of, of, of this work. That's really cool. Uh, so, so how does um, so so what made you choose the HP Edge line as the solution to deploy this? Yeah, so so we, we basically have um, we're targeting uh, smart city, uh, uh, you know, big science, and so on. And we wanted to have one partner that had a portfolio of, of, of hardware systems, which we could actually uh, target. And, and that's where we, we chose the, the Edge line because you go from the GL10 that has a, a very small uh, form factor. Uh, to the EL4000 that has you know everything you need in order to to, to, to deploy a, a, a CPU and memory intensive system. Makes sense. Yeah. All right. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. I'll stop and then we'll we'll restart. You can stay there and then we'll do the.